Greeting traders, in this class we'll be learning about the basic market structure. Now it is important for us to learn about market structure even though it is the basic of forex trading. However, there are a lot of traders that are unable to identify where the price is moving upwards, downwards or in a sideways range. Therefore, traders often make mistakes of buying at the top and selling at the bottom. Now, this is the mistake that we want to avoid. Definitely, we will buy from the bottom and sell the top to maximize our profits and also to minimize our risk in trading. It is important for us to understand the market structure before we start to trade. Now, let's begin our class. There are three types of market structures. The first is the uptrend, where the price move from the bottom to the top. Next is a downtrend where the price is moving from the top to the bottom. And the last is what we call the sideways or ranging zone. It's where the price is zigzag around this area. Let's look at the market structure uptrend. Now remember this. You need to know the high, low, higher high and the higher low. So normally price will form in an upwards motion. Okay. Where it will just keep continuous to break the previous high so once it breaks the previous high at this bottom here we'll mark it as the higher low price pull back and we mark this as the higher high and price will keep continue to go upwards now let's look here price has continued to create higher high higher low higher high higher low and then a higher high and it keeps break the previous high high where as you can see at this case now the price has come down and broke this higher low structure so once it's broke and the price continue to go up and broke this high high structures now when this kind of case happens this higher high and this higher low is invalid you will have this high high higher low your higher high and this will be your new higher low now let's look at the market structure for downtrend same as the uptrend where you need to identify and need to know the high the low the lower high and the lower low so for downtrend price will move on a downtrend motions where price will create the high low price pullback create the lower high and broke the previous low this will mark as your new lower low. So price continues to go on a downtrend. And we mark the structures, lower high, lower low, and price continue on a downtrend. Well, as you can see here, price has broke the previous lower high. And therefore, this lower high and this lower low is not a valid structure anymore. This will be your new low, lower high, your new, low, your new lower low, and this will be your new lower high now let's move on to the next market structure which is sideways from here you can see price will only move in a zigzag motion where there is a resistance line and a support line so price will move towards the support line goes up the resistance line and come back down to the support line and goes back up towards this resistance line so it only move between this zone now let's look at the example of the MT4 chart. Here on the market structure uptrend, you can see in the MT4, it creates a high, low, high, high, higher, low, high, high, higher, low. Same goes on and keeps going on doing the same structure. Now if we change it to the line chart, we can see even clearer. So this is your high, this is your low, your high, high, higher, low high high higher low and continue okay so the uptrend will only have this four structure which is the high low high high and higher low now let's look at the downtrend so in mt4 charts this is how the downtrend looks like it has this high low lower high lower low lower high lower low and let's look at the line chart same thing that happens for downtrend the high the low okay you can mark this as your lower high lower high this as your lower low lower low yes 
practice your lower high, lower low, lower high, and lower low, and continue. Okay, as long as it's moving downtrend, we should have this structure high, low, lower high, and lower low. Next, we look at the sideway. So, sideway in the MT4 chart, we can see that same thing. We should mark the resistance at the top and the support line at the bottom, and price is only zigzag moving in this zone. So, for SNR trader, normally they will take this opportunity to sell at the resistance and buy at the support. How do we use market structure to identify reversal? This is actually is not very difficult to identify and it's not very difficult to learn. Now let's look at the price. It is moving at an upward trend where it creates high low, high high, high low, high high, high low. And then when we draw a trend line, price will touch this trend line and bounce back up. Now what happened when the price decided to break this trend line? At the same time, it broke this previous higher low so it has created a new lower low at this area. Now, if we look at this, price comes to this trend line tested as a new resistance and continue to go downwards. Therefore, this will mark as a new lower high. If we draw this zone, this is like a QM structure. So this is an over and this is an under. So we entry the left shoulder and price will go back down so when a price is unable to break the previous higher high and continue to break this lower low therefore this is a sign of reversal now let's look when the price moving in a downtrend so in the downtrend remember the structure price will create low high lower low lower high lower low lower high lower low so same thing as well if we draw a trend line, uh, you can see that the price is respecting this trend line. So what happened when the price decided to break this trend line? At the same time, it broke this previous lower high. Price comes back down to test this new trend line that it broke and continues to go upwards. As we can see here, price has created a new higher low. And at the same time, this is a QM. Okay, QM, we have the over and under left shoulders okay at the same time we have this is a low high lower low high high price come back to test this left shoulder and continue on an uptrend so when the price is unable to break the previous lower low this unable to break this previous lower low and continue to break this high high therefore this is the sign of reversal it is easy, isn't it? It is not very difficult to learn, but most important part is that we keep practicing how to identify the structure, and this will be a very useful tool for us to trade in Forex. So what should you do next is go to your MT4, go to your MT5, go to your trading view, mark the six structures. You have to know how to identify these six structures, whether it's an uptrend, downtrend, or sideways. If you're able to learn how to mark this high, low, high, high, lower, low, higher, low, and lower, high, you will have an advantage in trading in Forex. We're going to use all these market structures later in most of our class. Okay? At the same time, you're able to sharpen and train your subconsciousness. The moment when you open the chart, you're able to identify what is the trend like. And how should we trade according to the trend? The more practice you make, the more you will improve further. The next thing that you should do is to do five screenshots of the market structure, whether it's uptrend or downtrend. Do both. It is better to practice your eyes. Mark it for uptrend, high, low, high, high, higher, low. For downtrend, it's low, high, lower, high, lower, low. Keep practicing. Do not stop. See you in the next class.